A few days ago, my feed was filled with more garbage. Once again, another new channel dishing out get good fast tips. This player, most likely never being good at the game themselves, scammed himself some views by telling people to look at their crosshair. Wow, you open your eyes and you're no longer heart stuck. Congratulations. The truth is, a tip like this is not going to make you rank up fast. It's not going to make you rank up at all. If you want to rank up, I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but it's going to take a lot more than that. A lot more. I know players who average hundreds of games in act, and yet they're still an immortal. Have been for a long time, and I'm in the same boat. If there was some get good quick tech, we'd have it. When you open up your game and see those radiance on the leaderboard, those players probably have a thousand more hours than the ones in Immortal. Just a rough estimate on my part. They play more than you, like a lot more. Oftentimes when I would coach players who were low elo, I'd ask them how much time they had invested into Valorant. They'd answer with numbers so low, I completely understood why they were where they were. Now there are many different ways to improve at video games, and specifically Valorant, and I'm going to give you guys some direction on how to improve with more specific videos on these topics coming after this video. These are going to be the videos you can expect from me in the next upcoming days, so if that sounds interesting to you, subscribe and join my Discord, it's free and you can always leave. The first thing is watching players that are better than you, keyword better than you. If you're a low elo player, don't go butterbeing yourself expecting to become Thanos because one, you won't be able to find important mistakes you're making and two, watching others who are better than you is the fastest way to learn and improve at any game. When you're watching, you should watch someone who you relate to, whether it be your ideal style of play, someone you look up to, like me, or someone who plays the same agent as you. Pay attention to important things they do like how they position themselves or how they use their utility. Next is one tricking. If you're under ascendant, pick one, yeah, one character, and my recommendation is always going to be a duelist. It's often recommended to fill in order to climb, but I am of the firm belief that if you're under 300 RR, you shouldn't be able to fill because you're not going to be able to play each role adequately. If you're a gold player, there's no way you're able to play each role well enough to keep switching it up. So just pick one character and stick with it. If you enjoyed this video, join my Discord where I plan to continue free VOD reviews, and I hope to catch you on my streams. Peace.